Has the ethnopharmacological search for psychoactive drugs improved or impeded human development? And I answer, the search for psychoactive drugs has defined the course of human development. Whether you believe magic mushrooms explain the missing link between Homo sapiens and earlier species of hominid or not, the evidence remains from anthropology and archaeology that the earliest city-states centered around the cultivation of crops for producing a tincture we nowadays know only from its name in ancient texts, Soma. According to these scriptures, Soma was a potent hallucinogen although its ingredients remain lost to us today. Many plants and some animals around the world contain psychoactive chemicals and different classes produce different types of effects. Acacia, for example, is a globally common tree that contains DMT, the psychoactive ingredient in Peruvian ayahuasca. There is a modern scholarly theory that different methods for ingestion of the same or similar classes of drugs resulted in the different methods for resulted in the different types of cultures that have evolved independently of one another around the world, as well as led to almost all wars between them. For example, sniffing or drinking, smoking or eating, and the different classes being stimulants, hallucinogens, analgesics, etc. Even tea and spice trade has led to wars when supplies get too low or too expensive. <laughs> 